what's going on, y'all. I know, I know, I know. It's been a minute, and it's going to be a minute every now and then, okay? Um, me and my friends were having a conversation the other day about about what it's what it really means for a man to go monogamous, for a man to go exclusive with one forever, such as marriage. And when I say marriage, I do mean with each other forever. I don't mean any of these new marriages that plan on breaking up and divorcing and all these other things. Now, I understand infidelity. I understand violence and things like that, right? Uh, but... But you're promising God, you're promising whoever it is. I mean, if you're getting married and it's not religious, if you don't want to be together forever as you're promising God, then why would you even do it? Um, obviously, the other answer is uh, some sort of monetary value or some sort of financial gain. So when it comes to uh, giving up or what men give up, it's... Um, it's almost similar to a woman's youth. Her youth is something that she can't necessarily get back. Well, youth in general, you can't get back. Um, so when a woman and a man marry young, and I say young, younger than 30, right? Their body still hasn't hit their prime yet. They haven't hit their prime all the way in general yet. So, um, you know, they're with each other and giving it, you know, giving their prime or giving their best years, in a sense, to the other person. Now, for a man to go monogamous, it's almost as if he's giving up his, for lack of better words, his mojo, his vigor, his, you know what I mean? Like, like when a man is single, in his prime, he's feeling good about himself, he's doing his thing. The way he approaches women, if he, I mean, depending on what kind of man we're talking about, but I'm talking about someone similar to me. That I'm going to go approach whoever it is that I want to approach all the time. So, um, but that's when I'm, when I'm single, right? There was a point in time, a decent amount of time when I wasn't single and I wasn't doing that. Um. But I, I felt like I became a different person in a sense because you give that up. Just like look at a man that's been married for 20 years, 10, 20 years, and, and then look at another man who is just married or who is single 20 years younger than that man. You know, it's, it's a whole different perspective. It's a whole different mindset of the man. It's... Um, not necessarily uh, because we're somewhat of apex predators as humans. So, uh, and men, we went and did. Um, so, in a sense, it's almost like giving that up, like giving up the chase, like giving up, giving up things that excite the man from a biological perspective. Um, similar to a woman giving up her youth, giving up the best years of her young life or her life in general, or giving a man a child. So, um, you know, because once she's given a man a child, her body is not the same anymore. Once she's, you know, older than 30, her body is not the same anymore. Um, it could still look great. It could still be great. But it's only getting worse for the most part. Like, there may be a little bit amount of time that you can stretch that, but that's it. Um, kind of like a man. Once he gets, you know, older, yeah, they say that he can still go and get women or get whoever he wants. Yeah, sure. But um, he, that's for sexual purposes. Any man or any woman can go out there and get someone for sexual purposes because there's always someone who's on that, right? But... To find someone who is a companion, who is worthy of um, bearing children or, or, or giving you children, you know, uh, and wanting to be with this person forever, that's a whole different story. So, uh, you know, that's something to think about. It's, 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 um, 
we give up stuff too that uh, women may not understand or see because we're different biologically. What makes you a woman and what makes you thrive as a woman is what's different than what makes a man thrive as a man. So that was just a little, just a little bit of two minute Tuesday or five minute whatever, five minute Friday. <laughs>